guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm back with another hack video for you guys. I love trying out new hacks, so I thought I'd try this one. This one actually involves vodka, so I am really excited to try this. Um, so I've got my little bottle of Smirnoff here. So it's another skin hack. I love trying new things on my skin just because I suffer with a lot of... Um, skin problems. Uh, it's calmed down over the last few years but I used to have really bad acne and I suffer with a lot of redness on my skin as you can see um, and I do get the odd breakout as well so I like to try all new things and just see what is good for your skin and what isn't. So today I'm using vodka as a toner and apparently it's meant to close up your pores a lot more. So all I've done today is I've just cleaned my skin. So I've cleansed it with my Dead Sea soap that I use as my cleanser. And um, I've just come into the camera a little bit. So around here particularly, my pores are a lot more open than the rest of my face. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to have got my cotton wool double faced oval pads from Boots here and I've got the Smirnoff little bottle of vodka here and um, I wouldn't usually use vodka for this but you know so I'm going to put some of this vodka onto this pad and I'll just get one out now and then I'm just going to apply it to my skin. So I haven't actually put anything on my skin yet. So this is going to act as a toner before I apply my moisturiser. Um, usually I use a different toner. Uh, if you've seen my skincare video before, then you will see that I actually use the La Roche-Posay Zero Zinc Toner, I believe it's called. And it's a spray one. Um, which And I really like that toner. But if this works, it will be amazing. Okay, so I've opened the vodka and I'm just going to put it onto this pad here. I'm going to drench the pad in it. Oh my god, I think I put a bit too much. Um, I'm going to drench the pad in it just to make sure that it is applied properly onto my skin. Okay, so now I've got the vodka on this pad. I'm all I'm going to do is I'm just going to swipe it across my face like this. I'm just going to put it everywhere that I would usually apply my usual toner to my skin. So basically all over the face, but just avoiding the eye area. This actually feels really refreshing, although it does stink of alcohol and vodka, obviously. Um, but it does feel really refreshing. I'm just going to focus on the areas where my pores are slightly more open. Okay, so once you apply this evenly to your skin, just let it sort of dry and soak in. So I'm just going to flap my hands around a bit so it soaks into my skin and is completely dry. And then we'll see what it feels like and what it looks like. Um, so yeah. Okay guys, so now it's all dried up and I'm not going to lie to you, but it feels absolutely amazing. Like my skin feels so good. It feels so clean as well. Um, I thought it would feel a bit, you know, horrible and sticky because um, usually when you get alcohol spilt on you or something, <laughs> maybe when you're out it does get a bit sticky. Maybe that's because of the sugar in the mixer. Um, but I've literally just put this all over my face, it dried really quickly, soaked in really well and it just feels absolutely amazing, like my skin feels so smooth and I haven't even put moisturiser on yet so I'm really really excited to see what my face looks like when I put moisturiser on but honestly I'm not going to put moisturiser on because we're just looking at the results of this vodka as a toner but I'll just move a little bit closer to the camera Like my skin, okay, it's really red, but that's always the case. But honestly, my pores look completely just closed up. So this would be the perfect finish. I'm just going to move back. <clears throat> this would be the perfect finish that you want your skin to be in before you start applying all your makeup. So it's like... Um, 
the perfect primer for your foundation as well. So I would highly, highly recommend this. It was so quick and easy, just like any other toner is to apply to your skin. Um, whether you use a spray one or whether you use one with cotton pads, I would definitely recommend this. And do you know what? I think I'm going to actually add this to my skincare routine because it's bloody amazing. It's so, so good. My skin feels so amazing. It hasn't irritated my skin at all. My skin's quite sensitive and it does go really red and it does flare up if I use something on my skin that my skin doesn't agree with. But this feels absolutely fine. No burning sensation. Sometimes with skincare products I do sometimes get burning sensation if my skin doesn't agree. Um, I didn't get any of that. It dried really quickly. It just feels absolutely amazing. So 100% recommend this and it's a hell yes from me. I absolutely love it and my pores look amazing, the perfect base to apply my foundation. So I'm actually going to go and do my makeup now and film some more videos <laughs> for you guys. But um, I just wanted to quickly do this one before I apply my makeup. So I hope you guys found it helpful. If you do have any more hacks that you want me to try out, um, or if you've tried this out and you had different results, then please let me know in the comments below. Um, please give this video a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Let me know how it goes if you do try this one out as well. I want to see what your results were. Um, and yeah, please subscribe to my channel and I have lots more exciting videos coming up for you guys and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!